So you want to learn LiDAR. You want to learn how to use this new technology. You want to learn all the different features. You want to learn how to best apply it, how to put it on a drone, how to do it on a car, how to do mobile mapping or indoor mapping or, you know, so many different aspects of LiDAR mapping and LiDAR applications. But where to begin? Now, you're here at this video, so I hope that these videos have been putting together on Indiana drones have been pretty helpful for you to, to learn LiDAR, but you know, there's only so much that can be answered uh, in a timely manner. Uh, I get questions all the time. So my inbox is just loaded with questions in the comment sections and it's great. And I, I really appreciate you leaving me and, and reaching out to ask me these questions, but you wanna learn faster, learn more. So, you know, we put together the, this community over at community.rockerbach.com and there at the community, we have a lot of our, you know, team members that are actually answering questions and we also have a lot of other users that are on there answering questions, asking questions. It's a great place to go to uh, learn more about LiDAR and ask your questions and, and get answers. So you can just go to community.rockerbach.com and, and ask those questions. If you have any questions about LiDAR, I encourage you to go there. And you know, this being said, this question could be about anything. It could be about uh, the DJI L1 LiDAR. It could be about the Regal LiDARs that go on airplanes. It could be about LiDARs in space. It can, it can really be about drones. Uh, how do you mission plan? What's the best way to mission plan on a, on a DJI M300, for instance, or on the, the new Astro drone from FreeFly? Uh, there's so many questions that you all have, and we're a part of a community, and that's really where I started at with this Indiana Drones project. Because before Rock, which is our company, and before that it was Indy, and before Indy it was, it was just you know, this company doing this service providing and being out there and I was doing training. I was training a lot of LiDAR systems. I was traveling the world and doing LiDAR. And, you know, I, I ran into this issue time and time again where I, I would show up to a job to train someone how to do LiDAR and they just spent, you know, $200,000 on this piece of equipment. And I get there and the first question they ask me and I have to tell them, I'm sorry, it doesn't do that. So I was kind of this bearer of bad news where I had to kind of break your heart a little bit and be like, you just spent $200,000 for something that doesn't do the thing that you need it to do. And it was just kind of crushing. But at the same time, it just let me know there's so much knowledge that just wasn't transferred to the, to the customer, to someone who's trying to make a living. Someone's taking out a small business loan to buy a piece of equipment to you know, give them an edge on the competition and, and, and deliver new services and products. And it, it was just, it just kind of sucked. Uh, and that's, that's what started Indy. Indy was really, you know, a way for me to, to reach out to as many people as I could and communicate and, and just start sharing some of the knowledge that I've gained over the years. So that hopefully someone else wouldn't make a similar mistake that I did. Um, and that, and that's, that's, that's really important to me. It's, it's important that you're getting just great information and you can learn from some of the mistakes I've made, but you can also learn from some of the things I've succeeded in. Um, and I really appreciate you coming with me on this journey because we're building a community. And this community is something that it's rapidly growing we're seeing, I live in uh, Menlo Park, which is next to Mountain View. And this is, this is where like the autonomous vehicle headquarters of the world is. I, there's autonomous vehicles driving around every day. I mean, in my old house, I had a, a Neuro car or a Waymo, you know, once, once an hour going in front of my house and they're covered in LIDARs. So you're seeing this technology, you know, in the autonomous vehicle space, we see it in the drone space. Um, there's just so many applications for this 3D data. Um, so it's, it's growing and I want you to be a part of that as well. And I, I really appreciate you joining me on this journey to, you know, learn, to be entertained about LiDAR. Um, and, and now Rock Robotic is, is my company. And I, I think you want to, I think I want to show you something really quick. Hold on. So I, I have this piece of paper with me and this piece of paper right here, this stays on my desk every day. And so what it says is one to many, enable others to win, 
work in the open, jump in and own it, and diversity. And these, these are really what I go by uh, every day when I'm, when I'm thinking about Indiana drones, I'm thinking about rock robotic, you know, is it, is it one to many? So can I make this video one time and talk to as many people as possible? Um, can I enable others to win? This is making the hardware super simple and you know, making the software really easy so that way you can just get it and just start making money with it. Like That's really the goal here. Um, working in the open, can I just, this is what the community I'm telling you to go to. It's like, if you wanna bash me or whatever, please don't actually do it, but you can and it would be in the open and that's cool. We'll, you know, be there in the open with you and, and talk it out and, and share knowledge. Uh, jump in and own it. That's just a personal, you know, I, I really like people that are just, just jump in and, you know, start taking stuff and, and like, I'm just gonna put this together and, and do it. You know, I'll ask for forgiveness later. I really like that. Uh, and then diversity, this is a, a global community and every part of the world is using this new technology. And so being inclusive for every different type of person, you know, from every race, every, you know, whatever your whatever is, I'm a weird dude and I just like it. I like everyone. I think, I think we're humans and we're fascinating people. Uh, so this is all, this is what we stand for. And I really want you guys to know that because I'm, I'm doing this for you. I'm, I'm doing it for you because I, I want you to get better and I'm doing it for all the people that I've interacted with in the past that I believe they deserved better. They deserved more information, better information before they spent so much money or before they chose a career path or it, it's just important to me. And I hope it's important to you too and I, I really do appreciate you being a part of this community. If you have any questions, please go to the community.rockerbike.com and ask them. Uh, I'm happy, I'll be on there answering questions, but we also have Matt uh, and David and Alex and Tim uh, and Chris, and we have a whole lot of other you know, users on there. Um, Daniel is a great guy, really like him. <laughs> Anthony, these, these are all, all awesome members of the community already. So uh, yeah, yeah. I'll see you guys over there, and thanks a lot for watching this channel. I really appreciate it. I'll see you here next time here on Indiana Drones.